Hey guys, this is Narelle here, and welcome back to a new video. This is actually going to be a sketchbook update for you guys, but I'm actually going to show half of this because this journal sketchbook is 150 pages, and I don't want to spend a whole video on this one thing, so look out for part two after this, and hopefully you guys like it. So I'm going to try not to spend as much time on each doodle because when I recorded this, it was 20 minutes, and I'm like, no. So, um, right here is a character I tried to make, but I did not. Um, here are some sketches of Rohei and Kahori. Here are some Yona doodles, because she really inspires me to draw. I don't know why. And then I drew all the dragons in a realistic style. So, there's Jeha. There's Sheen Ah, there's Kija, and there's Zeno. And I always found it funny how he doesn't have an Ah at the end of his name because J Ha, Sheen Ah, and Kija. You know, it's kind of weird. But out of the four, these two are my favorite. And then I did Hawk on the back, and then I found a picture of him on Google, and then I kind of made it realistic. It's not that bad, but the realistic style isn't for me. And I screwed this one up so bad. Like, if you take off the face, it looks amazing, but put it on, it looks so derpy. And here's a sketch of Aiko. Um, here's another sketch of Aiko, and here is Rohei doing a nude photo shoot, because I find naked bodies really beautiful, so I'm like, go figure so um here is Rohe with a more permed hair so um he looks interesting and here is that main guy from the yaoi I know kusabi I cannot remember his name but I failed on him oh so badly and here is Miku because if you cannot draw draw Miku as Nautica says um here's actually a sketch of Gotch suede from Letty Letty no from letter B because I've been wanting to do fan art of him for a while and I finally did it and I love it and I did these with a fine point felt tip pen so that's the reason why they kind of look markery because I just drew it with that um here's a realistic sketch of Almine here's some more marker doodles of Nick because I don't draw him that much anymore and I'm like crying and here's Usa like ever since I did that collab with Two Chronicle I've been spam drawing him lately it's weird um here's a sketch of Nice Show with his hair down and here is Nice Show with Nine and here is Naru and Naru because I don't draw them together that much anymore and I'm like no so um here's a unfinished doodle and here is Tenga from Kisniver he is my husband I love him like if you guys want to make me happy just draw Tenga for me and I will be your best friend and here is Crispy's little sister Mo Samchi and I'm gonna develop her a little bit because I like her character design and here is a visual k artist but those markers are drying up on me so it looks ever so bad here's some sketches of Rohei because I want to get back into Rohei I haven't drawn him a lot either um and here is a fan art of Lin Truly from the Taiwanese drama Our Times and that movie is amazing I saw it two times I might watch it again after this video because that's how good it is and this is actually one of my favorite sketches in here because I really love how I did her body Alrighty, so here's actually the sketch when I first started watching Yuri on Ice because all my friends were raving about it and I'm like, okay, I'll wait till it finishes. And then every one of my friends, like Choco and them, were like, Narelle, have you seen Yuri on Ice? And I'm like, no, I want to wait till it finishes. But I think this is when six episodes were out at the time. And I'm like, I'm going to just binge watch it and see how good it is because if Choco likes it, it must be good and I fell hard for victory <laughs> and I was literally through episode two and I paused it and I'm like I gotta do fan art and this is what I did and I showed Choco this sketch through Skype and she literally died so I'm like I guess I did that justice because when I drew this I didn't really like it as much but I'm like yeah I guess it's cute so um here's some gothic 
fan art. Here is Crispy Samchi because this is when we started working back on the squig digs. That's a fail. And here is Naru angry at me because I don't draw him at all. Um, here's my character Sina carrying his guitar. Um, here is Miku in her goodbye April Dopper outfit and I really love that song and here is a messy sketch of Aiko and here is a sketch of Rohei oh god this is my Dollar Tree list do not pay attention to that and here's a doodle of Chio because I miss drawing her as well and here is Alan from Pokemon because I'm like when did Pokemon start getting good looking characters like they need to stop because they're stepping up their game really hard because he is just too gorgeous for me and then I tried to draw a random girl but then she started to look like now and I'm like no I gotta stop and here's some random doodles of Rohei and Hiroki and here is Rohei if he was a pretch preachy no alrighty so here's Rohei if he was a preppy white guy because he it, he does come from a rich family and if he actually took over his dad's company this is what he would look like and I am not saying it's bad because literally he looks good with everything so I'm like oh okay and here is me trying to study on Japanese because I want to improve my Japanese language because I really want to learn it like it's one of those languages that I really like other than English so um anyways here are some doodles of Aiko because I got really into her character and this sketch I find ever so funny <laughs> because I made Nick slap Aiko's butt and for all you guys are just going to be like oh my gosh Nick Nick is not that type of person at all Rohei is that type of person so I'm like what if Nick did that to Aiko so Aiko's like Nick please move your hands and he's like why it's so comfortable and I'm like oh my god like it's nice putting your characters out of their personalities sometimes because it just makes a lot more character growth and I'm like oh my gosh and here is some fan art of my friend Starry's character Ghosty because she is ever so gorgeous and I love Ghosty like as soon as I saw her when she posted Ghosty on her insta I'm like I want to do fan art but then at that time I'm like my art sucks so I can't do it so I'm just like I gotta draw a ghosty so here's actually a visual K guy named Machi and he is from the band Meteoroid and I just find him ever so sexy and this photo he was just gorgeous and I'm like I got to do this of him and he has an Instagram so I will actually link his Instagram on the screen if you want to follow him. And here's actually a fan art of a Sime from the Yaoi Rogue. I cannot remember his name for the life of me. I really need to do my research before I record my videos. But hands down, he is one of my favorite Sime's. And I'm just like, ah! And this to add on to it, he's a gangster. So he totally won my heart so um then i did a copic blob and then i drew what i saw and since i was raving over yuri on ice of course i drew a girl ice skater and i really like it when they turn and when they hold their legs i find that really graceful so i just did her doing that and i really love this so, um, this is actually fan art of the girl from the Vocaloid saw my R, and I think the R means reason. And warning, if you go to look at that video, it's really depressing. The ending, I did not see that coming. So if you can stand a depressing video, I recommend it because it's a good song. But if you cannot handle depressing things, I do not recommend it at all. So here are some sketches of now and I think the orange was done with a highlighter because I found highlighters in my room and I like I got to use them so yee so um here is now and Hayden Hayden is a shared OC between me and mama cupcake but he kind of belongs more to her because she designed him as a whole he's just in the Naru fan so that's kind of where I fit in but um this is them having a bro moment because they're 
personalities are ever so different, but I'm like, even they would have a bro moment at one certain time, so they're just like, yes. So, um, yee. So, um, here's a felt doodle, another felt doodle, and here is some more sketches of Aiko, because I'm loving her nerdy self, because Aiko is actually a big nerd until she changes her appearance to look more gangster-like, so this is basically how she looked before with her big glasses, and yes, and this is actually her going to her middle school prom, and a guy asked her out, and he was the most popularest guy in the school and he did it as a joke so as soon as she got there with this dress on and this dress is actually a hand-me-down of her mom's and it's not the best condition but as soon as she got there he was like oh my gosh you're so ugly like who like why did you believe i would even want to go to something with you and he kind of already had a date plan instead of her and she's like oh my gosh i actually thought i looked pretty and that's when she kind of meets nick because she runs away from that and yeah so that's the reason why aiko changed herself um here's actually a doodle of chisana because I got metallic pins and I use the silver on her pearls and the silver isn't as strong as the gold and this is the gold I just drew a random headshot of a guy that's not a character and that gold is just flawless for dollar pins they are really good so um here is my mouse character russell and here's just a um random guy that i tried to make into a character maybe i will i don't know and i love this side view i don't know and i just realized my school information is right there i'm like way to go nyrell so um here's a drawing of russell and his little brother ro buying some bagels because they really love bagels and ro is like i want to and russell was like bro i only have enough money for one just settle on one bagel so um here's a sketch of kohori here's a sketch of my old character taiga and this is like a redesign because the way he looked before made him resemble Nehru. and i'm like no that is not happening so this is kind of how he looks now and now the hairstyle looks like crispy and i'm like god i just gotta change that again and then this is when i was making crispy's ugly outfit because with the squig digs when you see them in school they look really ugly but when you see them perform they look ever so gorgeous so i had a time trying to figure it out because i didn't know how to make a character look ugly so this is kind of what i decided on and all the members kind of laughed at that and they're just like oh god chris we cannot go in the world looking like that so um and here is a sketch of my character Crispy seducting Igor, who is Choco's character, because Crispy has a more of an advantage over him, because Igor is kind of like the weakling of the group. So, yes, poor Igor. And here are some sketches of Rohei, because I don't draw him that much anymore. And I did these sketches with a collar ace in green. So, yes. And here's a quick doodle I did of Nan. Now, here is my favorite sketch in this sketchbook. I love this sketch hands down and it's of Rohei and Hiroki and I use so many mediums on this and I'm surprised this paper even stayed together. But anyways, I love this so much. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Ah, I love it. So here's actually a 20 minute doodle I did with JMI of my character Kahori. And he finished his doodle in like 10 to 15 minutes. And I was struggling. And I'm like, JMI, how are you done? And I literally had to color this thing really fast because I am not one to leave a sketch without color. So yeah, I struggled. But at least the sketch turned out semi-decent, so yas. And here is a sketch of Yurio from Yuri on Ice, because he's my favorite character, like, 
guys i have a weakness to sundades i don't know why i just really love the sundade characters and yurio is my life so i drew him going to practice and this is him actually skating with his hair back because i love it when he has his hair in that ponytail i think he looks ever so gorgeous so yes and then i drew a character that's not a character because i think it's fun to actually draw something that is not yours every once in a while so i just decided to draw a random chick and the saying is when life gives you troubles just dribble on because she is a basketball player so um here's another sketch of chisana with that metallic silver pen and she says shut up and she's either talking to chio or rayo because that's just how she is with them and this is her when she's younger and this is when nice show first got her to pearls and i didn't color them so i might have to go back and do them after this video but um yeah and this is the last part i'm showing you because you see the m and it's basically up a picture of my character nara or Rebecca, her real name is Rebecca, and basically this is how she really looked before she changed into that, so basically it states, I used to hate my soul being until someone special showed me how beautiful I truly am, and she says, thank you, Naisho, and Naisho is Naru and Naru's dad, obviously, so um, yeah, that is it for this part, so thank you guys for watching, tell me what sketch you really liked in this, and I will see you in my next video so bye